Okay. Here you go, Louie. Tell us about your car, Lou. Well, this car is a 69 Chevelle. It started as a Malibu sports coupe. Originally, it was my mother's. They she bought it brand new in 1969. It started out as 307. And then I uh, decided to uh, retire the car from everyday use. And, oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, my mother gave it to me as a present when I came back from the Navy. You know? Mm -hmm. And I used it for everyday use. And then I decided to retire it around 1975. And then I decided to... Uh, Build it up. So I, you know, I got rid of the 307, put a 350, and now I got a 406 motor in here. It's a uh, 11 to 1 compression. You keep going. And uh, you know, like uh, I just got the motor in there last year, and I'm ready to, and I'm ready to uh, have the car repainted. Mm -hmm. I had it ever since. I mean, since the day my mother bought it new. And it runs like a. This thing runs really wicked. <laughs> <laughs> With the 410 gears and a 3500 stall converter and the shift kit on the automatic. Oh, forget it. The car just goes all over the place. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I'm going to get a new paint job this coming July. Brand new when I get back. Mm -hmm. All red this time, right? Oh yeah, the original guard red. Yeah, show us the stripes. What year was it painted, Lou? This car was painted around 1980. Around 1980, around yeah, just 81 around that area was painted. It lasted about 20, uh, over 20 years. Mm -hmm. and, you know, and I. Excuse me, innocent bystanders. <laughs> so she, she has a little part of history, you know? Mm -hmm. This is maybe the last time I'll be ever doing any kind of major work on a car, you know, like, uh, <laughs> I'm getting very old on this stuff. <laughs> no, you're not that old, Lou. So tell us a little about the motor. Well, the motor is a uh, brand new, it's a yeah, four, the original motor that, uh, I'll, I'll videotape the motor for you. Yeah, the motor itself, I, I put it in uh, about a year ago, and I had the motor done by uh, PCHS, and, uh, I had the block line board, uh, the, uh, you know, I had a, Rods and the mains all clear, you know, for clearance, you know. Mm -hmm. I got AFR heads, uh, two twenty, uh, AFR two twenty sevens. She's running eleven to one compression, thirty over. The, um, the chambers uh, had to be seventy six cc's in order to keep it down eleven to one compression. And the cam I got here is a Com Cam two eighty H with uh, 1.6 roller rockers and molly push rods. Uh, put a little aluminum distributor that I just put, put in here. And, uh, and uh, basically, uh, the valve covers, uh, the original valve covers that I had in my 350, I had it powder coated. Ford Blue. <laughs> Ford Blue, <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> I, can, I told him just to you know, you find any kind of blue with this, use it. <laughs> so you did him for it blue. Yeah. <laughs> I did all the electric. Okay, the, uh, on the tunnel ram, it's a uh, Edel Brock TR1X, the old TR1X. And as you can see, it's side mounted, the carburetors. Mm -hmm. The carburetors, I'm using a pair of Holly 390s, you know? Because at 6,500 RPM, it's only flowing at 700 CFM, so I got it. And these two combined, I get 780 CFM. Okay. You know? The uh, rear end, I, the uh, transmission is a Turbo Hydro 350 with a uh, shift kit and a uh, 3,500 stall converter. 
change the rear end from a 10 bolt to a 12 bolt uh, posi unit that has 410 gears. And I did a little, uh, yeah, modification, uh, yeah, on the suspension, you know, like uh, the. Uh, I got a real sway bar on the uh, on the uh, on the rear end. Mm -hmm. Makes the car handle really nice. You know, the car is raised about a couple inches higher to uh, because every time I, 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 it would scrape the uh, the the, uh, the headers or the uh, or the transmission oil pan. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's raised about a couple of inches. You know, got heavy duty springs. You know? Both sides, both sides. That's what I have here. So tell them the truth. Is it faster than the Rambler? <laughs> I don't know. I'll still put the video on if you like. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? I have no comment on that one. <laughs> That's a question mark. <laughs> What's the deal with the driving gloves, Louie?